obviously we forgot to change the baby seat from wife's car to my car now it has to be altered right wait please The exposure on the camera wasn't set to show you the rainbow, but it was beautiful. There it is! It is beautiful! Is it safe to say that it might just make this day better from the start? Is it like a prediction? Hopefully it does. We were late really, really bad. But somehow, we were able to catch up. And it's not so bad right now. Not ideal, but not bad. And yes, if you're gonna ask me, I envy my wife so bad. I would love to have that car for a week. Let's, let's talk about ideas. This thing that I'm doing right now, at some point, was just an idea. And we all have ideas and we never know which one of them might be a total crap or it might make us a million bucks. Nobody knows about that. But every single one of us at some point has something in their head that wants them to create something, to do something new, to build to show the world something that they've never seen before and hopefully maybe not to just do it for the part of creation but maybe make a life out of it, make money out of it and as obvious it is, I'm not doing this for the money I'm doing it for the idea itself for achieving a goal and trying to see if I can achieve something that I set in my mind. There is one thing that I've learned when starting doing this or before I started doing this. You cannot sit on an idea for too long. After speaking with many of my uh, successful friends like in business, in creating, uh, being better in everything that I do than me, the one advice that they gave me was just do it. Don't think about it. Don't think about what people are gonna say when you're gonna fail or if they just simply won't like what you're gonna do, make, create. Just do it. It doesn't matter. Opinions doesn't matter. What matters is what you think about what you've done and what you've created. If you are happy and you can actually move to another idea, another goal, then it's great. Don't ever think about what people might say about you. And that's the whole thing why we procrastinate on ideas. Instead of doing them, we just sit on them. And the problem with that is that ideas that are being held for too long are beginning to be kind of a Frankenstein. There's a bit of that coming into the idea and, uh, and a bit of that. We stop thinking about that part of the idea. And the whole thing from being that nice, round, Thing becomes some kind of a 
spiky ball and it's never as it was at the beginning. The creation or the making of the idea a reality should be just made when it's still that round nice shape and it's at the easiest of it to be done. And at the same moment we've got the most drive and power to pursue it. When we start overthink it, it becomes a big problem. Oh, I cannot get money for this, I cannot do that, I can't approach that person to help me. And it just becomes like a huge problem. And then we just say, oh, it's not worth it, I'm not gonna do it, it's just pointless. Let's just leave it. And that's the problem that people have the most, the execution. Whenever you have an idea, you wanna do something, create, make, just go and do it because we are too much afraid of what other people are gonna say about us when we fail. It doesn't matter if we fail, just go and do it. As long as you are happy with whatever it is that you're doing, nothing else matters. See, like an hour or two ago, it was raining like crazy when I was recording time that time lapse. But look at now. It is beautiful outside. I can't really see anything there or here because there's so much sun. Everything's working. And this might be like an example of what I was talking about. That was obviously something small. It wasn't a big idea, it wasn't a big dream. But then yet again, if you wanna do something, just do it. I wanted to clean uh, my office and I did. Just go and do it. Obviously my jeans are ruined right now and I was sweating like a pig that knows his dinner. But I managed. You never fail until you stop trying. Because when you fail and try again and learn something and fail and learn something and try again and again and again, eventually you will get better and you'll finally do what you wanna do. The moment when you actually fail is when you give up. When something's not right, something doesn't work, and you just say, okay, that's the point where I should just stop doing it because it's obviously not working. Don't ever do that. Whenever something doesn't go as you want, just stop, think about what you just learned, and try again, and then again, and again, and again, until you finally 
achieve it. That's that's just something I wanted you to to know. This is my kind of a small philosophy about just trying and doing things that you really want to do. Just never ever give up and eventually dreams will come true.